Seth Henry, economics major, basketball player. Balancing basketball and academ academics or athletics in general is very difficult, but you get into a routine where it becomes more easy. And I think the fact that we're in, involved in athletics every single day for two or three hours, maybe even four, um, really drives the competitive nature that we have and it carries over into the classroom. So just because I'm really tired from basketball and practice and working out, I also want to get a really high grade on the test next week so I can get an A in the class. So um, I think that is like a pushing factor for athletics that I think um, a lot of students appreciate. <laughs> Special Olympics of Pennsylvania came to Carnegie Mellon four years ago. Um, to establish this as the foundation for the Western um, Spring Sectionals. And I was introduced it, um, to by an old friend, old teammate of mine, James Ormond, who um, at the time was on the basketball committee. And he basically told me to come out, volunteer, um, see what Special Olympics is about. And when I went out the first time, it was just really life-changing. Um, I got to referee a lot of the games, um, talk with a lot of the athletes, and see how hard-working determined they are to win, but also foster um, friendly competition and I just really wanted to make this day, those days, like the best possible for not only the athletes but the volunteers and committee members. My senior year I was talking with uh, Mike Ermer who was the competition director for the western portion of PA and he was basically asking me like is um, being a competition director of competition for CMU something I was interested in and I thought that I could have a really big imprint on this year's Special Olympics event. So I decided to take that on. I really believe that being involved in this role not only allowed me to expand my horizon of what Special Olympics really is about and how many different factors go into making this day really special, but also helping the athletes was something that I was really passionate about and something that I hope I can continue down the line when I move back to Maryland and DC.